What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Distinguished Kicks, and this is my YouTube channel, which I keep forgetting to mention. The, t the title of my YouTube channel is All About Souls, where I give you the latest in kicks and tech, <clears throat> mostly on the kicks, but I'm working on the tech. So, um, if you're new to my channel and you'd like to get more inform you know, more details and more news on kicks and stuff, do me a favor, like, subscribe, comment below, and give me a thumbs up. It don't cost you a thing, but please subscribe and tell a friend and tell another friend, and then you can tell another friend to check out my channel. Well, right here, I'm gonna just cut through the chase. Um, my wife and I went to the Nike um, in Detroit, Michigan and uh came across these and uh i'm je i'm jealous and yeah i'm hating but hey it is what it is and as you can see if you are familiar with nike and their um their stores they usually get the shoes returned and they cut off the top of the box so it's not like an outlet it's like a community store for us um but let me cut through the chase, like I said before. Um, these are the Air Max One Premium uh, Denim Leopard. And um, I like these. I wish I could find these at a reasonable price because she got this. This is like a steal. I mean, she got this for dirt cheap. Um, she has not put these on yet, but only because the bottom look the way they do because she tried them inside the store. So, yes, she got these for dirt cheap. I'm talking about way under the retail price. And let me show you what the retail price is. Um, the retail price for these are 160 As a matter of fact, in certain sizes, they're still on the uh, sneakers app. And as you can see right here, her size, size 8. She's, you know, she fits, fits between a 7.5 and an 8. And you can see the details, mini, medium blue, white. Um, I think it's blue. I think this is French terms, but y'all can read that. So anyway, <clears throat> I'm very upset um, that she got these and I couldn't. So let me go ahead and give you some my thoughts about this. Um, I like these. I mean, these is these are hard to me. These are hard. Um, I like they put a lot of detail. And uh, into the shoe um, the denim is nice and once again because I am using my phone um, the denim is darker than what it is in your hand so please do not think it's that dark it's not it's a little bit it's like your typical dark denim blue jeans but not too not this not that dark um, <clears throat> the denim going around the toe box is nice I'll get a closer look see how that looks right there you got the yellow stitching going all the way around the front of the toe box, all the way around the back. You got this um, 3X stitching right there. You got the stitching right there. Um, you got the Nike swoosh, which is like, uh, it had these designs in it. I want to say, like, not paisley design, but you can see where the details are popping out of the swoosh. And the swoosh is leather. Um, you can also look at the toe box. You still have that same kind of design coming from the swish all the way into the toe box, which is kind of which is really clean. I put a little little regular natural light on this so you can see it. You have the leopard, which is also like a, almost a suede material. Could be a cloth material. It has a cloth material, but it's still nice. Then I'm going all the way up on the side panels so on the medial side and the lateral side once again the nike swoosh has that nice little design pattern in it i'm trying to see if it looks like some swans or something i can't really tell if you look at the uh collar you can see it look like some flowers in orange and red or yeah orange and red the panther design <clears throat> all the way to the back of the heel with some more 3x stitching right there nike and and white stitching and Air Max and white stitching with that nice denim panther, I mean leopard design coming all the way up around the back. You still had that denim going all the way to the back with the yellow stitching, which is really nice. Um, it, the collar inside the shoe, you have that, uh, what do you call it, diamond material, I want to say fabric material. 
I'm trying to think what kind of it's almost like a jersey type material, but it's not a jersey. Uh, it's not. It's the. I'm put it this way: the pattern of the the cloth or the fabric is made almost like how jerseys are made, but it's a little bit more. It has a more rough texture, but on foot, my, like my wife was telling me, they're comfortable. And we're gonna get to with we're gonna get to these in a minute. Uh, the inside. You see the uh, insoles with the Nike swoosh look like Nike in a fan pattern. I'll turn it this way so you can see it better. See how that looks? That's kind of cool. Now, the eyelets up at the top of the collar is gold on both sides. See that? The tongue itself also in denim. As you can see with a leather patch right here with Nike on it and air, which looks like it's a... Um, Embroiled, embroiled, I shouldn't say that, uh, burnt or stitched, etched in the leather. That's what I want to say, etch. Um, the back of the tongue, you see that nice little pattern right there in the back of the tongue. And that's kind of different. That look, What is that? I can't really tell, but it's a, it sounds like, what is it, hound's tooth type material, type style. Uh, you got your information on the back of the tongue. The laces, only one set of laces, and these is this would make the shoe stand out really nice because they're rope laces, and these are these are nice. I I, I think the white, any other color like brown or any other other colors on the shoes would have messed it up. I think the whites make the shoe stand out more. Uh, the tips of the laces, there's nothing there. They're just plastic tips rounded up to round off the the laces, and let's see the midsole as you can see is white white midsoles the air bu bubble is in the orange color orange is red as you can see there on the bottom you already seen the pattern there the uh, traditional air max one um bottom sole and on the front as you can see now the quality on this one, I don't understand why somebody took it back. Um, when me and my wife looked, had seen these shoes, I went over the whole shoe to see um, was there any quality issues, anything wrong with the fabric, or maybe it's just because they didn't like them in hand and they decided to return them. So I'm gonna put this one back. Oh, and the QC code right there in the box. Who cares about the box? The box is already destroyed. But anyway, um, this is a very very clean shoe i don't know if anybody wanted to go out and get a pair of these but i'm telling you um if they still have your size available and you've been thinking about pulling the trigger do it um you, or you could wait and you can go to the out your nearest outlet walk up in there and maybe they might have the pair up in there like i say i don't know if you get the same good price that my wife did but just the, the right time at the right right time in the right place um th and we was going to leave but she decided to walk around some more when that's when i seen these but uh these like i said before are hard i'm talking about these are nice I'm, i mean the yellow the yellow stitching makes everything the yellow stitching the rope laces the man the whole shoe just pops it's just i don't know my wife thinks for myself that i shouldn't get a pair because she doesn't like she think men to wear shoes that have a leopard print on it doesn't doesn't look cool. But um, I keep trying to tell her when I put some jeans on, that's gonna be covered up, so it's not gonna make a difference. But you know, if I come across a pair at a reason price, I'm gonna get them. I'm gonna get them. I can't. You can't stop me. <laughs> you can't stop me. But anyway, so if you decide you want to pu pull the trigger and get a pair of these, don't. You know what's the what's the saying? If you think if you're gonna get it at the time, get them because we don't you're not going to be able to get them or the price of them is going to be really high. So if they still on sneakers app, go ahead and pull the trigger. I think these are cool Air Max one premium, um, denim leopard. You can't, you can't go wrong with this. I mean, I mean, that's just, wow. That's just sweet. I've been wanting to do a review on this shoe for about a week or two. That's how long we had them, but I just never had the time to do it. But, uh, you see, I got, I had done them already. I changed the laces back to white, but, yeah, these is hard. I mean, these is, man, these, to me, these are harder than, than them. I don't know, but I know different shoes, but still. Well, anyway, y'all, this is your boy, Distinguished YouTube channel, All About Souls. Leave a comment below. Let me know what you think about these. 
like I say, like, subscribe, and like I always say to you guys, stay safe, stay blessed, and aim for something or you're going to miss everything. Um, another shoe coming soon. Hopefully tomorrow it'll be here. And hopefully it's just not to the point where it's old news. All right, y'all. Peace out.